Why does sorting this array with the numbers 4, 11, 2, and 23 result in this array with 11, 2, 23, and 4, which seems completely random? Now, the issue here is just how the sort method works in JavaScript. We can pass an optional comparison function to the sort method, but if we don't, which in this case we didn't, we're really treating the elements in our array as strings and then sorting them based on their UTF-16 code unit values. And UTF-16 code units are just the numerical representation of these characters. So in this case, our array is now stringified. Four becomes a string four, which maps to 52. 11 is treated as two characters both mapping to the code unit of 49, 2 maps to the code unit of 50, and 23 is also two characters, 2 and 3, which map to 50 and 51. Now to sort these characters, JavaScript compares these values character by character. So first it compares 4, so 52, with the first one from 11, so this is 49. And since 49 is smaller, 11 comes before 4. It doesn't care about 11, it just cares about that first individual element in 11. And this process continues for all the elements until the entire array has been sorted. The original array is now also updated to reflect this updated order based on the string comparisons, but the original array still has these numeric values. So the sorting here happened based on the character codes and not their numerical values. That is why the end result doesn't really make sense for numbers. If we do want to sort the array numerically, we have to pass a comparison function, for example, this one. This comparison function subtracts b from a. So if the result is negative, a comes before b, and if it is positive, b comes before a. So this ensures ascending numerical sorting. But why would JavaScript default to stringifying elements if this seems so intuitive? Well, the issue is that arrays can hold mixed data types. Within the same array, we can have numbers, strings, booleans, and so on. So by converting everything to strings, JavaScript avoids type errors whenever we want to sort an array. But it's always good practice to just pass your own comparison function when working with sort to uh, avoid some surprises. <laughs>